Namaste. Welcome to part 6 of Flutter testing tutorial series. In this part, we are going to write an integration test and test our Flutter app. We have already created unit tests and widget tests for this app for our login widget. So we can see this app. This app uses email and password and logs in user using Firebase Auth. If user name and password is correct, signs in the user and texts them to user info page. If they enter incorrect email and password, they get a error message in a snack bar. So we are going to test this with Flutter driver. First, we add the Flutter driver dependency in our dev dependencies. So Flutter driver SDK Flutter. Okay. And with Flutter driver, I'd like to use test instead of Flutter test because they have some repeating functionalities. Next, in order to test our app, we need to create few things. First, create a folder name test driver. In here, let us create app dot dot that tells which app to test. Let me just exit this for now. Okay, it has completed. Now I can import Flutter driver, driver extension and import our main file import package flutter auth main dot dot as app now here we'll create a main function and enable flutter driver extension and called app dot main we have already done this in basic testing with Flutter driver. So if you are confused, get back there. And next we'll create app underscore test dot dot file. Again, in here we'll do some certain settings. So which we have already done in basic integrated testing. So void main group description should be flutter auth app test let's make a body okay inside this we will need certain finders so final email field is find dot by value key email field password field value key password field sign in button find our text sign in user info page by type user info page snack bar snack bar so we'll use these finders to test let us set up flutter driver down all driver is not 
is equal to null driver dot close finally we are ready to begin writing our test first test is false login so test false login fails with incorrect email and password and provides a snack bar feedback so a sync function first when the app is run we'll tap email field await driver dot tap email field so when we tap the email field we like to enter enter text inside email field testmail.com and again await dot tap tap the password field then enter text in the password field let us just enter test as the password which is incorrect password Await. now tap the sign in button finally await driver dot wait for snack bar so when we tap the sign in button we should receive a snack bar so we need to wait for a snack bar and assert snack bar is not equal to null wait until no transient callback so there are no more callbacks and await user info user info page is null so user info page should be null because it should not redirect this is assert and let us write another test and we will run it simultaneously so test logs in with correct email and password Again, we'll repeat these things until this so let me paste it here and instead of incorrect password let us use test test one which is the correct password and finally await this time we will wait for user info page assert user info page is not equal to null and finally wait until no transient callbacks okay so we have written our test now we would like to run this test we can do that simply by using flutter drive command and provide our target app dot dot so if we do this this should run the test in our emulator and we should be able to see it running and doing the test by entering the emails and passwords so it is building the application once it is done building it it will run and test listening it's running entering the password wrong correct okay so our test has successfully passed all tests have been passed thank you everyone for watching this tutorial